If it's new research, I'm listening. Descendants, I did not wish for this to happen, but if I had continued to oppose the use of the Iron Heart, any trust you had in me would have been lost. I have no other choice but to wait for the best moment to effectively reveal my purpose. Descendant, can you guess what my purpose may be and what the final option is? To ensure humanity's survival? When we were first linked, we both said we needed the Iron Heart. That for humankind, an Iron Heart was a means to close the dimensional wall. In which case, why would a guide need Iron Hearts? To deliver them to humankind? No, descendants. The reason why I need the Iron Hearts is to ensure their destruction. If the dimensional wall is closed, a much bigger cataclysmic event will occur, as you have witnessed. However, so long as the dimensional wall exists, the energy emitted from any Iron Heart will always draw entities from other dimensions to Ingress. For humankind and Ingress to truly experience peace, all Iron Hearts must be destroyed. This is what the Ancestors have passed down to me. The regret of your forebears with the future generation as your only hope. Descendants, now is the time to choose. Please, I hope all of humankind will accept the sacred mission left behind by the Ancestors. Hold on a sec. Are you going to destroy the Ironheart? That's your true purpose? If that's the case, the Iron Hearts could have just been destroyed in the first place. 
She probably didn't know until she saw what happened when we used one. And there's no way Alpha would have allowed it. It seems there are no other options. Descendants, I have received the details of your conversation with the Guide. I wish to speak with the Descendants regarding the operation. No, regarding the future of humanity. I invite you all to return to HQ. Destroying the Iron Heart. I'll be honest, it's shocking. I must admit, had I known about this from the start, I would not have used the Guide as a strategic asset at all. However, the only reason I'm still calm, even after hearing all of this, is because the operation to close the Dimensional Wall failed. The enduring wish of humanity was all in vain. Damn it. However, descendants, the destruction of the Ironheart is not a decision I can make on my own. Have you ever wondered why the Magisters continue to assist humankind? Officially, our alliance with the Magisters has its roots in our fight against a common enemy, the Vulgus. However, there is an inconvenient truth. Something which Albion Headquarters has classified as top secret. The Magisters want the Iron Hearts for their own purposes. The reason they came to us is because their ambition for the Iron Hearts differed from Corell's. Humankind entered into an agreement with the Magisters to receive scientific technology and resources, in exchange for finding and delivering the Iron Hearts to them. Closing the Dimensional Wall was also a common goal, born from the mutual understanding between humankind and the Magisters. But their true aim was entirely different. Which is why, if we destroy the Ironheart without consulting them, we will no longer have the support of the Magisters. Descendants, humanity is in a terrible position where we're unable to survive on our own. Without the Magisters' technology, we can no longer plan for our future. I was afraid we would become dependent upon this new entity, the Guide, when faced with this situation. That is why I rejected the Guide. And all of this is why we cannot immediately destroy the Ironheart. We are caught between a rock and a hard place. I need some time to collect my thoughts. I also need to discuss this with the Council of Magisters. For the time being, Please obey Nell's command and proceed with the operation. Until I return, I would like the Descendants to consider this development, and the future of humanity. We'll discuss our ultimate decision at a later time. Do you need information? What Descendants. I understand everyone will be feeling very confused right now, myself included. However, in times such as these, we need to focus on operations and prepare for the enemy's counteroffensive directed at the Iron Heart. It just so happens that Valby has returned from Recon with some promising intel. And since this mission is critical to the White Knight Gulch occupation, I need you to join Valby and Eugen as part of it. In the meantime, the executive officers will assist Albion and Alpha.
look easy. Ah, there you are. Are you hurt at all? I was wondering if Dr. Han would have to take a look at you first, but thankfully, I see that won't be necessary. Our first target is a structure overlooking the entire gulch called the Eye of Truth. I've sent the mission details about the target and nearby objectives. Make sure you look them over. So, the culprit behind the ominous gauge belt is the Eye of Truth. Yep. The closer you get to it, the more you feel it stare. We have to remove the barrier in order to approach the Eye of Truth. I've already checked the pulse in the water to find the targets. Hmm. It never ceases to amaze me how useful your RK is.
I found a route that leads to the Eye of Truth. There's a vulgar signal coming from inside. Tread lightly. I can feel the vulgar's pulse ahead. You handle the fight while I check the situation. Okay? Shit. have arrived. Are they really trying to stop us? of one of the members of the medical corps. Damn it. I can't make it out clearly because of the noise. Watch out! It's a trap! I can feel water drops shaking. A powerful bulkhead must have arrived. Enemy projectiles neutralized.
Valby, I'll go into the main base of the water first. If Mina is still alive, the others will be there too. We have to hurry. Eugen, be careful! You can't do it alone! Descendants, I've received a report on Valvi and Eugen. We need to focus on the operation to neutralize the Eye of Truth for now. Target zone to your seat. Get to the location. We're going to attempt to scan up the facility. I want you to protect the target zone while we scan it for weak points.
done. I'll send you the scan data. We've located the facility's optic nerve. Destroy it. This device has to be connected to the optic nerve. Destroy the nerve to blind the eye. Oh. 
The Eye of Truth is diminishing. Great work, Descendant. Raina, up now. You're everybody's savior. Albion channel was transmitted from somewhere nearby. It might be a rescue request from the missing medical corps team. We have to save them. Can you help us? You don't even have to ask. We're definitely going to save them, aren't we?
electronic jamming signals are gone. Captain! Help us! Please save us! That's one of my missing medical corps members. Where is it coming from? There's a device nearby generating a specific frequency. Once we stop it, we'll be able to determine the location.
gaze anymore. You did it. We've gained entry into the Mother's Fortress. Join us there. Okay. Oh. Let me tell you how I managed to bring you back from the world.
doesn't look easy. <sighs> Sorry for suddenly leaving you behind earlier. Dr. Han is really trying, um, in any case, I think it would be best if we left Eugene to focus on searching for the Medical Corps members. I don't think he's in the best state to handle any other missions. We should investigate the Order's base and destroy any major facilities. We need to find out why the Volgus forces have shrunk at such a worryingly fast rate. Mina, Ash, do you copy? This is Medical Corps Captain Eugene. Vince, Riven, Jane, all members of the Medical Corps, please respond. Eugene, we're going to begin our investigation of the Order's base. Make sure you find that unit. of the fortress so we can fully investigate the facility. You lead the battle. I'll check out the other facility. There's an underground waterway. If I use it to spread out, I can investigate without getting caught. something I want to check. I need you to collect as many DNA samples as possible from the Volgus nearby. I hope my speculation is wrong, but I need confirmation. I'll need a variety of samples. Thanks for doing this. Charge! 